to do exactly what Coach Cut is saying, you know, just yeah. play broken, play broken play. Uh, north of Marseille on France as in the World Cup host next year. Rugby World Cup 2023 is the prize that is dangling tantalizingly in front and looking to be champions again, but more importantly, to qualify for a seventh Rugby World Cup. It's uh, red, red and blue. Captain Red! Ludovic Kerr asked if both captains are ready. They are. Comes to a head tonight. A fourth game in less than two weeks. It is puffing up with a superb piece of defence. Let's go, let's go, ten please. However, kick out from the back of the try line means that Namibia will get it back again and it's Vento who comes charging through as he did regularly against Zimbabwe. Nice little offload as well into the hands of Danko Berger. Kenya though still keeping the line of defence well in place and it comes once more from Stevens, and it's been intercepted. It's a knock on. More good defence from the Simbas. The two lock forwards have also linked up for a brilliant try as well. Asando and Okeo. By uh, Geswin and Mouton. Stevens once more. Feeds it out. Here it is. Rousseau tries to go round the back of the uh, number eight. Bethwell Anami, who had a brilliant game against Algeria. Namibia, though, on the attack. Lausa feeds it out to the inside centre. Berger once more. Again, more heavy hitting coming from the Kenyan men. Another big hit comes in onto Johan Retief. Lausa, straight interception. Kenya all of a sudden it was that man who's had the best start the hooker for Namibia is on fire in this it was a speculative offload from the scrum half but it was picked up by the forwards and they ran with it and Wien Conradi scores a beauty and it is Namibia who scored the first try after 17 minutes here in this winner takes all final to see who goes to the rugby so then Ivan loves up with the chance to make it 7 nothing. First blood to Namibia. And it's all because of an all guns blazing start to this game over the sticks. And Namibia lead by eight points to nil. Proud of the uh, team today because he failed at HIA test and so could not play Roos and turns on the afterburners breaks through three or four challenges and he was so close to going all the way it's John O'Koth in the end who brought him down they got the uh, two big forwards he just brushes by and then another Nobody can stop him. Power all the way for Namibia. And great control as well in the grounding. And Kenya are being left behind already. Despite their good play, they are being... Well, Kenya have not beaten Namibia since 2014. And that fabulous day that they managed to beat them in Rugby World Cup qualifying. Really compound the damage and take it beyond two converted tries. And he does.